We at the Blue Barn are proud to support the Omaha Summer Arts Virtual Festival this year. I'm gonna show you kiddos how to make paper flowers. I use tissue paper. You can either use one color, a solid color, or a pattern color, kind of like these here. Lots of different kinds. I personally like to use two colors. So I use a pattern, and then I choose a color that's in the pattern, and I do every other one like this, and back and forth kind of, you can see that. Um, there's eight pieces per color, so a total of 16 pieces. This one is a five inch five inch square. It doesn't have to be perfect. You can cut it with the scissors. I have a paper cutter too, so sometimes I use a paper cutter. Um, you can use do a bigger size as well though. Here is the bigger size. See that guy? It's fill in space. That's an eight incher. So all you do with this is you take your pieces of paper after they're layered and you go back and forth with it, kind of like a fan, which is cool. Once you get it there to the very end, you then can take pipe cleaners or wire. Pipe cleaners are a little more fun. You can hang them on all sorts of different things. And you just twist and twist and twist and twist like that. Then, a little tip, you don't have to do this, but a tip is you can then cut edges on both sides like this. Like that. And then you slowly open it up. Open it like this, one at a time and you keep going. Sometimes you'll rip and that's all right. But it's okay if you rip some of it because every flower is different, right? And keep going like that. And once you have both sides done, it looks like this, a little hydrangea. Thanks a lot.